I don't know what I've been told. Email's best when it don't scroll. Hey, Strongbad, what's the dumbest law the king of town has ever passed? Don't you think you would be a better ruler than the king of town? Your pal, Roy T. Castle Hill. Well, Roy D., it goes without saying I'd be a better ruler than the king of town. But seriously, who wants that job? Stuck in a castle all day? Stuck making dumb laws? Probably stuck in the bathtub? No thanks, man. And the king of town's mostly harmless. Sure he's stupid looking, as the scientific diagram illustrates. But he stays out of my business, and that lazy fair approach to government is a welcome alternative. Oh, I think I'd like to go to the lazy fair. Aha! Uh -huh. Caught you red gloved it! The king of town? How'd you get in here? In flagrant disregard of my new email tax, eh? One creamy ding snack cake for every email sent or received! Email tax? Flagrant? Creamy ding? Oh, so you refuse to pay! Boopsmith, administer the color of obedience! What are you doing? Hey, You're cut under that house out. arrest! Ow, you have freedom. the right to bribe me! Anything you offer will be eaten by me, whether cooked or raw! Try walking past that fence downstairs, and blammo! Hope you weren't too attached to that head! And one more thing! My map! I need that! This will make sure you stay put until you can pay up! Now let's ride, Poopsmith! Gotta go collect on my new pour a bag of jelly beans down my gullet tax! House arrest? Oh man, this is the worst thing to happen to my style in a long line of bad things happening to my style! I gotta find a way out of here and give that uncharacteristically oppressive king of town a serious mustache pounding! I want your soda! The complete suite of Edgar Ware anti-spam, anti-virus, anti-malware, anti-mail, anti-productivity, and anti-disestablishmentarianism software. I want your soda! Ah, uh, my trusty steed. Stooley, I'd ride you into email battle any day. Hey, Strongbad, what's the dumbest law the king of town has ever passed? Don't you think you would be a better ruler than the king of town? Your pal, Roy T. Castle Hill. Yo, Strongbad, is Homestar still trying to find Hibber to be in the Homestar army? I want to enlist, but only if he helps pay for college. Ready to fight, Ben F. Well, Benf, the Homestar army will take just about anybody. Our Homestar already blew their entire scholarship fund on an invisible time machine that I sold him. So sorry, no college fund. Which bringeth me to my second point. I'm not thinking your biggest obstacle in college is going to be financial if you get my drift. I'd start figuring out where in your parents' basement you're gonna hang your Bob Marley poster once you move back in. Bonjour, Strongbad. What's the deal with that Homsar guy? I can't understand a thing he says. Is he making fun of me? Confused, Paul W. Athens. Bonjour, Le Paul. Nobody can understand a thing that Homsar says. Theories abound as to the cause of this baffling condition, but one thing's for sure. He is, like the rest of us, regardless of language, creed, or beliefs, making fun of you. So thank you, Les Paul, for bringing people together. Meow, meow. What's up, sexy strong bad? I'm a looking at this one all out already. Don't take this the wrong way, but we think that Pom Pom is the hottest. Is he available? Jules and Jess, noisy chewers. Oh, ladies, I guess? If I weren't already swimming in a hundred dollar bill shaped pool full of email offers from co-educated females, I might be offended. But I am. Splash, splash, emails. So I can afford to let Pom Pom have a little overflow action. I don't know about his availability though. He usually stops playing the field at around a hundred girlfriends. I wouldn't get my hopes up if I were you. Most of the girls' pom-pom dates have names that don't sound suspiciously like two dudes. Jesse the boy, and Jules the Vernes' great-great-grandson. P.S. You both look fat. 
PPS double burn. Hey, Strongbad, what do the rest of the On Point Kings do when you're not hanging out with them? And are you still looking for new members? Lloyd Reno. The On Point Kings is a pretty exclusive group. The toughest of the tough, the coolest of the cool, and the somethingest of the something. That pretty much rules out guys in Reno named Lloyd. We'll keep your resume crumpled up and stuffed down Strongmad's tube socks, though. As for what the Cheat and Strongman do when I'm not around, I imagine they sit around discussing whatever cool thing I did or said or sat on earlier that day. Those guys have the unspoken bond of lifelong friends. Which is good, because speaking isn't either of their strong suits. Dear citizen, this message is to inform you of the new email tax, effective immediately and retroactively in the form of one creamy ding snack cake per message sent or received, including this one. Please make a note of it. Violators will be persecuted. Your ruler for eternity, the king of town. P.S. Direct all complaints to my hinder. I still say the wording of that message is legally vague. I want a soda. I can't unplug the Lappy. It takes five to seven business days to fully charge the battery. Lappy don't charge on weekends. I really gotta update that sign with something more forceful. But uh, that sounds like too much work. Stupid king of stupid town. Gotta remember this date. The worst day in the whimsical history of wrongful imprisonment. I want a soda. Intriguing. Not so intriguing. Prepare yourself, test commencing. <laughs> I didn't prepare myself. Free strong bad. If you're no one cares. Nothing interesting. What was all that noise about? Oh great! Stuck under house arrest with no one but little Lord Fat Leroy, the most depressing kid brother ever left on the front porch by gross gypsies. That's never been proven. The king of town put me under house arrest. House arrest? That's not fair. Seriously? I mean, wait, why are you upset? I was hoping you'd get sent back to prison and I'd get some peace. I've got an unassembled model of the Con Tiki that's just waiting for your next incarceration. What's the best way to destroy an invisible fence? Well, if you can short out the transformer, then do that. Otherwise, burn- Hey, wait a second! Is this something illegal? No, it's a radio call-in show question. Hurry up so I can be the fourth caller. I don't want to get charged with eating and abetting a criminal again. Come on, Dumplo. Help me get rid of that electric fence. I won't break the law. You probably end up burning the whole house down anyway, with me in it. Well, that was the plan. I used to like Sloshy, until I found out they had short hair and glasses. If you Quiet, you. Strong Sad likes to call this his deathbed. I like to call it his wet de bed. Sparkling clean. Must have been Obsessio Depressio's turn to clean the bathroom this week. It's my turn every week. Strong Sad's old security blanket. Strong Mad's new athletic region towel. Hey, who put the Muscle Face 2 movie poster up in the bathroom? Uh oh, wait, it's just my reflection. Who's the star of this game? That's right, you are. I stopped looking through these cabinets after I found Strong Man's tube of below the belt paste. Jubilee, jubilee, jubilee. Strongman's room has been off limits ever since that crate of bug bombs mysteriously went off inside his closet. It should be all cleared out in about a month, though. 
Ah, uh, toilet humor. Oh, potty humor. Ah, uh, commode humor. If you're gonna beat me up, make it quick. I've got a full agenda today. Strong sad suicidal house plan. If only we had read his journal, we might have seen the signs. An invisible fence that makes your head explode when you cross it. Seemed like such an awesome idea when I recommended it at the last town meeting. My crown from Blubbo's! Why did they ever stop making the jalapeno and king snake meat double deluxe? Why? I probably could have finished making Dangerous 3 by now if I hadn't spent so much time working on that teaser poster. Pretty good likeness of the leading man, though. Well, hello, Mr. Hot. I'm gonna stop hitting on myself. All right, the Tarantula Black Metal Detector. Now it's built in shovel attachment. Ah, my wall is exploding with video games. Ah, meow, meow. Let's see, what game have I got queued up for the fun machine? Math Kickers featuring the Algebros? Man, what are video games gonna learn? You can't learn from video games. Energy ball attack! Energy ball attack! All right! Energy ball attack! All right! I'm the master of hand-to-hand -hand arithmetic! Factor this! Quadratic formula, awesome! Level up! Energy ball attack! Energy ball attack! Ha! Take that, played out internet cliche! Energy ball attack! All right! I'm the master of hand-to-hand -hand arithmetic! What's this? Polynomial boss fight attack! Lame! Stupid played out internet cliche. No, wrong, I didn't lose. With just a bed and a li just a bed and a little imagination, home organization is a breeze.
with just a bad Those are pendants from various academic institutions, unaccredited and discredited alike. A big fat pillow filled with big fat dust mites. The key to surviving in prison is to not hang out in the laundry room for too long, or Shiv City as I like to call it. couch is in pretty bad shape. I gotta stop sleeping so hard. Tanks from the 23rd and 48th Battalion were flanked by tanks from the enemy's 56th Battalion. It was then that General Smithfordshire revealed his secret weapon, a slightly larger tank. And we only get the History Unleashed channel? This is torture! Part 8 of our 24 part series on the history of salt. Oh man, I knocked the stuffing out of the couch again. I gotta stop having those dreams where I'm trapped in an elevator with Milkmaid Homestar. Trogdor continues to torment me with his brokenness and not working osity. Few can withstand the otherworldly horror of Ugrug, the world's ugliest rug. I don't like the way that hush puppy's eyes follow me when I walk around. How come none of the Dutch masters ever worked in the medium of wood burning on tree slice? Oh man, of all the weeks I could have picked to install steel bars on all the ground floor windows. Or at least it stopped strong man sleepwalking. Ah, uh, the smoke detector, a.k.a. the place to find a spare 9-volt. What's in the cheat commandos O's box? A free sugar-frosted eye patch, just like the one fight car wore in the episode Chickled Pink Eye. Cheat commandos O's are a delicious part of this ridiculous breakfast. I love how the fridge smells like rotting vegetables when there's never been a vegetable in it. Hey, Dumple Stiltskin, feeling drowsy? I am a little. Wait a second. Are you gonna try and smother me with a pillow again? Well, not now, since you ruined the surprise. What are you guys doing here? Can't you see I got enough troubles? I'm a political prisoner. That's why we're here, Strong Bad. This is a peaceful protest rally. Peaceful? Free Strong Bad! No taxing without representing. Save the bats. I even wrote you a protest song. Come on, everybody now. Can't you hear the wind blow? We don't like the king of town making people's heads explode. Ah, cruel and unusual. Are you losers just going to stand around losing or help me get past that fence? That would be illegal. I can't go back to the joint again, man. I ain't going. We started a collection to help pay your back taxes. You're welcome. Why'd you bring that ugly, misshapen stick? She organized the protest rally. Not marzipan. Though that's a pretty good one. Gotta remember that. I'm talking about that stick dangerously close to the invisible fence. That's our orphigy of the king of town. Or orphigy. RPG. First person shooter! Effigy? That looks nothing like the king of town. Yeah, Buzzy Pan made us take all that stuff off. Right, Homestar. We're protesting the actions of the king of town, not the man himself. What the power! We was gonna burn it, but after looking at that pathetic thing, our hearts just ain't in it. 
We want to fry up the king of town, not stickball Jackson. Man, this is so unfair. I gotta write an angry letter to my doughy congressman. Didn't you see the warning message about the new email tax? No, I didn't see the warning message about the new email tax. All messages from the king of town get intercepted with extreme prejudice by my idiot filter. But I say you all kinds of reminder emails. Idiot filter. But I say you all kinds of reminder emails. Idiot, never mind. Any ideas how I can break house arrest and get past that fence? No, but I've got some great ideas for things you can do indoors. Build a birdhouse, make a rabbit lean-to, construct a beetle pagoda. Any ideas that don't involve me wanting to blow my brains out? Hmm, probably not. Shouldn't you all be putting a torch to that quote-unquote effigy? Eh, it's just a stick. Can't really get into protest in a simple stick. My people, we can no longer suffer under the invisible boot of this power-mad tyrant. A call to arms! Who's with me? Strong man! Me? I suppose you think you're really funny. I'm never gonna get out of this house. Don't worry, we'll be here for you every day until you're released. Singing songs about freedom and compression. No! Man, ain't that always the way? The one day an interesting package comes in the mail is the day you get put under house arrest for tax evasion. Hmm, I guess I could wait for an eviction notice. That would get me out of the house. I'm gonna have to get rid of that fence before I become a sickly, pale shut-in like Strongside. Power to the people! Wow, Marzipan. You've outdone yourself this time. You really nailed the eyes. It's like I'm staring into the king's beer-battered soul. Save the bats! Royal robe and size husky? Check. Hey, to cheat! What's red and fat and smells like rancid meatloaf? <laughs> no, the other thing! <laughs> Stupid crown that gets the king all up in my grill acting like he owns the place or something. Check. The king's morbid obesity. Check. The king's ridiculous looking beard that's supposed to hide his lack of a jawline. Check. Oh, hello, king of town. It's him! It's the guy! Burn him up! Burn the king! Oh well, take him out, boys. Sweet, recently divorced Lady Freedom! Onward to Strongbellia! Strongbellia, the free! Hey, that's the name of this. Uh, 